Astrid, my god. What, Mother? You don't like my outfit? So what's the story? We didn't go to Mexico to buy DMSO. Barry beat you, he raped me. How bad does he have to be to get you out of jail? Can't believe what's happening. When I get out, I'll make it up to you. Who said you're getting out? I said I'd talk to you, I didn't say I'd do it. And what do you want? I have a deal to make. A trade. You tell me the truth, I'll lie for you in court. The truth about what? Everything you kept from me. And if I don't? Then you can rot in here. I hate this look, by the way. Your Sunset Boulevard Motel. $20 hooker in the back of a car. Why'd you murder Barry? If I submit to this, you'll testify? Yes. Self-defense, he was killing her. Claire didn't do anything to you, why'd you go after her? Claire went for herself, I just showed you how to do it. Who was my father? Your father? Well, he always asked that, it's ancient history. It's my ancient history, who was he? His name was Klaus Anders. What did he do? He was an artist. How did you meet? At Venice Beach, at a party. He had a drug. Did you love him? It was a long time ago. I'm not the same person. Liar. You're exactly the same. Answer the question. You're such a child. You've taken my propaganda for truth. So set me straight. Did you love him? We had a very sexual relationship. One overlooks many things. You worshipped him. I read it in your journal. Worship isn't exactly the word we're looking for here. Who's Annie? What? Who was Annie, Mother? She was a neighbor who took in kids to people's laundry. What did she look like? Dark, curly hair, freckles. Did she take care of me? How could you possibly even remember this? It will only hurt you. Imagine my life for a moment. How unprepared I was to be a mother of a small child. I felt like a hostage. Can you understand how desperate I was? I dropped you off at her house one afternoon to go to the beach with some friends and one thing led to another. It was wonderful. You can't imagine. Take a nap in the afternoon and not have to think. What's Astrid doing? Where's Astrid? Mommy, 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 clean me like a spider. At the end, I would just wanted to throw you against the wall. How long were you gone? About a year. Give or take a few months. My God. But you're not asking the right question. Don't ask me why I left. Ask me why I came back. You should have been sterile. I could have left you there, but I didn't. Don't you understand? For once I did the right thing. When I came back, you knew me. You were sitting by the door and you looked up. You reached for me. It was as if you'd been waiting for me all along. I was always waiting for you, Mother. That's the constant in my life, waiting for you. Will you come back? Will you remember that you tied me up in front of a store, left me on a bus? Are you still waiting? No! I stopped when Claire showed me what it felt like to be loved. What did you think? That I'd amuse you? That's what babies are like, mother. What, did you think we'd exchange thoughts on Joseph Brodsky? I thought Klaus and I would live happily ever after. That's what I thought. Adam and Eve in a vine-covered shack. I must have been out of my mind. You were in love with him. Yes, I was in love with him, right? I was in love with him and Dave makes three and all that crap. Then why did you leave him? Why did you leave him? I didn't leave him. He left me. You want to know about your father? He left us when you were six months old for another woman, and I never saw him again until he showed up looking for you when you were eight years old. He came to see me. Yes, he came to see you, but it was a little late, wasn't it? Why should I let him see you after what he did to me? Because it wasn't about you, Mother. It was about me, and I wanted to see him. My whole life, I wanted to see him. That was my decision, not yours. It's always about you, never about me. I knew you were gonna kill Barry and you didn't even care. You didn't give a damn about what that would do to me. I'll say whatever Susan wants, but I gotta get out of here. No, no. You don't just walk away from me. I made you, I'm in your blood. You don't go anywhere until I let you go. Then let me go. You look at me and you don't like what you see, but this is the price, Mother, the price of belonging to you. If I could, I'd take it all back. I would. Then tell me you don't want me to testify. Tell me you don't want me like this.
tell me you would spend the rest of your life here to have me back the way I was. Listen, forget it. Deal's a deal. Just leave it at that.